248, like I'm in the area. Ten more. 130, Lincoln, traffic south of the main and 10th Virginia Tag, Union, Sam Henry, 9773, USH 9773, it's on a Chrysler. Goodbye to most truck to pedestrians. One sixteen. One sixteen's an hour. Ten four. One thirty, Lincoln. Be advised, vehicles not stopping. We're headed towards Rivermont. Uh, Forty, be advised, the vehicle was struck two pedestrians. One thirty, Lincoln. If you can also let Amherst County know before Rivermont. Fifth, going Rivermont, going across the bridge. Speeds are 40, no traffic, occupied two times. Is anybody with you? Got an officer, nigga. River Mountain Library, no traffic, speed 60. Which way are you headed? Towards Bensboro. River Mountain early, no traffic, 65. One thirty one time, you can also let the police know if they've got anybody in the area. 40's responding to you, Coast, and you by yourself. Copy. We are River Mountain passing Green for our speed 70, no traffic. Link on if you can also let Bedford County know. 40 to 240, are you on channel 1 and available? Yeah, I'm clear, no one whistle. 42 to 130, speed advisor that comes back to the same subject that ran last night. Alright, looks like we are taking Bedford Avenue. Get it back towards the city. Bedford Avenue, speed 55, no traffic. I'm getting on Bedford now from Bedford Mall. All right, you're going to come out right at it, uh, Titus. We're coming Bedford back towards Rivermont. I don't know if anybody's got any spikes. Link on, let Amherst County know, see if they can get started towards the border. I do not have spikes. All right, Rivermont in uh, Monsview. Rivermont in Monsview. Rivermont Park Park Pier, headed back towards Bedford Ave. All right, I'm on Bedford Ave right here at the Ark. Let me know which way you're headed. We're continuing straight. Back towards Early. Just going to dump out on Rivermont. Back on Rivermont, headed towards the city. Downtown. Rivermont in Boston. We're going to be dead in here in a second. Dead in in a second. We are Rivermont and Sabina. I've got spikes at Rivermont and Victoria. Rivermont and Fredona. Rivermont and Fredona. Coming out back towards Rivermont. Headed right towards the uh, Bedford, towards Boonesboro. Turning left towards Greenbrow on Grayson, left towards Grayson. We're on Grayson. Made a left on early, left on early. No traffic. Alright, we are on early, making a right back towards um, Bedford Ave on Park here. No traffic. Left on Ruffner, left on Ruffner. Left on Essex. We got him right here. Who's right there? We're coming up to you, Hoss, uh, Titus. I'm not going to let him ram me. To uh, get this guy off the road. We, he ran from us last night. Comes back to Jonathan Poe. He's got violent history. 
and we had a pursuit with him last night. He almost struck two pedestrians and he hit it towards downtown. One Mayflower Drive. Here's the international paper for accident. Unknown vehicle has been flipped. Hour. Light traffic. You copy me, 40? Yeah, I copy you. Let's just see where he goes. Approaching the Rivermont Bridge, speeds approximately 60 miles an hour, light traffic. So, say so vehicle is on the Rivermont Bridge, approximately 75 mile an hour, light traffic. It's occupying the right hand lane of traffic. Crossing Fifth Street. 40 is involved in the third vehicle in. Enos 1. I'm in route. Are you confirming there's one driver and he's out of the vehicle? Speed approximately 20. Light traffic. Six and a half. Enos 1. Caller say that everyone was outside the vehicle. The vehicle just flipped over. Three has spikes. I'm currently at Fort. Just finished my stop heading towards you. We're on fifth head towards Park. Okay, thank you, my girl. This street going through the roundabout, passing by Jackson Street. Speed is approximately 45, 50 miles an hour. Light traffic. We're continuing through the light, headed towards the pump. Anybody near glass with spikes? Passing Fillmore on Fifth Street, approximately 60 miles an hour. Light traffic, headed towards glass. Crossing through the light, Fifth Street going straight on towards Ford Avenue. Speeds approximately 73 miles an hour. When come, he will hit 1050. Medics code 3, in front of glass. Medics code 3, in front of glass. I got one of them on the way. When come, shut his fire. <laughs> Engine four, medic four, it's on the EC glass. Pulling them out. Pass here, you take four. Guys, that's fine, we need all units here now. On EMS, correct, EMS one, I need you to respond to EC glass, three shots fired, exchange with PD. 130 link on, stay off the radio. Shots fired. Next go three, have them stage at the uh, life saving crew. Next go three, have them stage at the life saving crew. Working on Langhorn, we'll take that. Nasty, talk to me. Ask him, Shelter 10 4. We have new officers here. Do you have an exact location where this occurred? All units are at the EC glass. We need you to stage as a life saving crew. Be careful coming in here. When you get the glass and leak that, check up. We have anybody with a barricade? One thirty link on. Advise state police to continue coming to us. Where you need units? It's a four lane car, we're in route. If you see me blinking my light, you need to move to the left or right. You're in my line of fire. Temper, just be advised to stage as a life saving crew. Temper, copy that. Hey, Miss One Lane Crime, how many patients do I have at EC Glass? It is engine six in the house. They will be way closer than engine four. One thirty lane Crime, if Amherst County has a patrol dog, send them to our location, code. Three. On scene, we're at stage and at the life saving crew. You guys need to watch a crossfire, okay? We gotta watch crossfire. See if we can make any kind of voice contact with them. Whoever's in the tray in the yard needs to move here on my line of fire. 
Person, get over here. What? EMS one. Uh, let me know the status on Amherst County. Also, let me know what the state police says. We advise both departments. We've had shots fired. We're still unsure of how many patients right now. We're trying to get further. To three. All right, ten four. When you can start engine six, you can disregard engine four. Working on that. Rescue one, look up. Rescue one. Four on scene. I've got a uh, four wheel car upside down. I don't believe anybody's in it. Um, we cannot see him. He might be leaned over. Last visual contact, driver was leaning to the middle of the car. He was laid over, leaning towards the middle of the car, popping up occasionally and shooting. Good for you, can disregard. Medic 6 on the Alright, hold what you got. Let's continue to try to make contact. Use the PA if it's safe. If it's not, you gotta use your big boy voice. 130, what did he hit? Did he hit a parked car on I-5? Yeah, he lost in this corner right here. Hit the parked car. Okay. Yeah, yeah Miss Walden, I'm in the area of station. Engine six and a half. One thirty to all units. When you get here, execute. I don't care what side you're coming from. Stop at glass or stop up in the police cars. This is a very active, fluid situation. This hole we have. Keep making contact. Do not stop talking to him. One person needs to give him commands. Talk to me. Amherst patrol dog is en route. Oh my God, we're flipped. Yeah. Before advising of the situation. Yeah. Exit up. Engine 6, Langham. Engine 6. We're going to have to pass the scene to get to the life saving crew as they requested, so we're going to stay to uh, Langham Road. Copy. Action on him. Negative, we have no movement, no contact, no cooperation. 10 4, 41 counters. Amherst coming, go through with that dog. 10 4, they are. Clear Mayflower in route DC plus. 3 with that dog. Medic 4. With the Bearcat, sorry. Being with uh, Medic 3 and EMS Life, the life saving group. Six, it'll be the stage of Langer and Rosalind. Come on, copy. As soon as that Bearcat gets here, we're going to get up with a team to get close to see if we can make contact with them. Which side do you want the Bearcat on? Come up on the right, right hand side of it. When come, give me a status on Amherst Dog. We're going to call them back and get their location. Matthew, I'm just checking on you guys. Make sure you're not hit. Make sure you're 10-4. For everybody in my group, in the front of the car is 10-4. Yeah. Oh, We have medic station in the area. Ten four, they're all with the life saving crew. One thirty links out. One thirty. Have them circle back around to the family dollar parking lot. Advise them, I'm sorry, but we need them to circle back around the Dollar General parking lot. Dollar General or Family Dollar? I'm sorry, man. Dollar General. Come on.
It is on the EC Glass High School. The PD is requesting that you circle back and stage at the Dollar General on Lakeside. 130, Lincoln. 130. We're talking, Lincoln. Into the city where we'll need some barricades. Also, if you can send out a tweet that the uh, memorial between Lakeside and um, Langhorn is going to be shut down, avoid the area. And need barricades. Approximately five from each side. Definitely. Units by Clark Ave. Get that mail to move away from the scene. Does that barricade give you any levers to see him? It would if I pulled up. What was the type of... I'm going to pull up. Pull up. Let's see if we can get eyes on him. Everybody hold what you got. Guys, get that mail by the church and move out of the way. Mail is laid over the center console. Can you see his hand? Negative. Can you? Can I see his hand? I'm going to stay in this position and keep giving commands. I can see him. He's not moving currently. I'll let you know if we get any movement. Can you tell if he's breathing? We need to try to get him in cuffs and render aid. 130, link up with medics. Did you copy from the Dollar General? Yeah, far, they're moving around. Paul, here's what looks like to be his back at a fast rate. There, There is movement on him. Well, we cannot see his hands. We can see nothing of his hands at all. 10-4. On that side, give me two barricades. If we have two barricades over there, let's put them together and get in front. We don't have any, sir. All right, we're going to be moving to the left-hand side of that bearcat. No, keep, keep the bearcat where it was, persons. So pull it up. I was backing up so you could offload barricades. You have barricades in the truck. It's too late, though. See, I've got a barricade in the back of the, the tack truck. What do you want me to do? Just to respond to Mayflower. Barricades have two people walk up with them, have lethal and hands-on behind. We have to get him out the car now. He's moving. He's raised his head. He looked around, moved his arm. Raised his head, looked around, moved his arm, laid his head back down. All right, stand by. Wake up. I need an ETA for the K-9. Kevin, they're supposed to be getting back to us. We're going to go call him again. Rescue one, look up. Rescue one. Clear, ready for service. Can you check cam with your naval patrol dog? Advise that we've had a shots fired incident. Call on a pursuit. Call officers at 10 4 when we need a dog. We can get one. Come on. Mail moving around, taking his head up. Laying it back on the seat now. 10 4. Is there any way to see his hands? If we come from the passenger side, it's the only way his hands could possibly be seen. Temple. These side curtain airbags are down on this right side. He put his hand on the steering wheel, tried to pull himself up, and then went back down. I can see his left hand. I cannot see his right hand. His left hand is no longer visible. Ranger. Nails raising up. Left hand on the steering wheel, nothing in it. Left hand on the steering wheel, there's nothing in it. He's holding on to the steering wheel. Cannot see his right hand. He's pulling himself up. Stand by. Get his commands to crawl out of the vehicle. Get him the commands also to put his right hand up. We've got to see his hands. Driver is leaning back in his seat. I can see his face. Uh, he's got blood coming out of his nose. He has not put his hands up. I cannot see his hands still, but he is laid back in the driver's seat. Should his face should be visible. Keep giving those commands first. If we make the approach from that side, are we going to be able to see him with the barricades? 
If you come from the passenger door, there is an airbag that is laying down, but you have to look down underneath of that. That is going to block some of your vision. Right. Same right. passenger side. There was reportedly a passenger initially. Yeah, we requested it. LPD-130 to EMS-1 or Battalion-1. Whoever's right here in this family, not a lot. That was doing a lot. We cannot see the right hand anymore. Cannot see the right hand. He did raise both hands for a moment. There was nothing in his hands. Cannot see his hands anymore. Get Get him to do that and stay that way. Let's make the approach. we got to get him stayed. Medic, six my count. We're clear. The male has moved in fully into the driver's seat. He's pushed himself back into the driver's seat. We cannot see his hands. He's moving his head back and forth, but we cannot see his hands. 10-4. Do you guys have any barricades down there? We have two barricades in the back of the tank truck, which I can't get out and get to all the things in the Let's go ahead and secure both of those safely. Somebody provide cover. Let's get two barricades out of the back of the bear gap. 41 count. We got Campbell County and route. Can you call them to get an detail on their dog, please? 10-4, Campbell County is coming code 3, and we told them to come straight to the Dollar General. We, you got a better vantage point than I do. If you think it's safe to make an approach with those shields, you got to let me know. Need radio. He's reaching over the passenger seat. He's looking at y'all. People at the front of the car. He's looking in your direction. He just put his hand over towards the right seat. Cannot see his hands. With him still reaching over there in the passenger seat, do not make the approach. I can't see what he's doing with his hands. I did notice what appears to be an entry wound behind his left ear. 10 4, keep giving a command. Like I'm making note, he's still reaching into the passenger seat. He keeps looking over towards you guys, and then he reaches towards the seat. He keeps looking over that way. Do not approach. Give me an update. Is he still moving? He, his hands are still out of sight. His head has minimal movement, but we cannot see his hands still. Lee, give me an update from your perspective. I don't know what you can see. Can't see his hands. His head's rolling back and forth. Just move his right hand, there's nothing in his right hand at this time. All right, as soon as we can see that both hands are empty, we need to make the approach to get him out of that car. We call. Left hand is up to his head. All right, both his hands are on his lap at this point in time. At this very moment, his hands are on his lap. I don't know if they're on top of something, but they are on his lap. His left hand is up. Person, can you see if his hands are on top of anything other than his legs? Negative. I cannot see his hands. Keep making those announcements, John. Both hands just came up. He put them back down. He's got his hands up. He put his hands back down. He will, he will not need to watch his hands. Are you guys making an approach on him? Yes, we're taking him into custody. Let me know as soon as he's secured. We need to get the medics up here. He has been pulled out, and they are doing a search now. He is not detained yet. They're rolling him over, but he's out of the car. 10 4, give me a minute, get up there. Chest seals, everything. We got the gun on the passenger side. 10 4, we got medics need to come in now. Clear from the Bearcat, I'm moving the Bearcat forward so that the medics can reach. And now you can go in to treat the patient. Clear the rest of the vehicle if we haven't already. 
We come. Vehicle player. Engine six. Engine six. Lee Cobb. No. Lee Cobb, where are the medics? They're coming. Where are you? No. Medics, are you the patient? No. Engine six. Go ahead. See if one of you personally in. Go ahead. Do you still need the Campbell County K9? Negative tone to disregard the thing. 50 to 40. Go ahead, 4. When he has a minute to safely do so, can you give me a call? Go ahead. Call we have a police alarm. Just here. 144 to any unit with crime scene tape. 116 to 144, I believe. 22 has crime scene tape if you want to go in that vehicle. 10 4, can you go in and unlock it for me? 40. Go ahead. Just got a call about shots fired in the area of 1103 Y Street. Complaint heard eight shots. Didn't see or hear any vehicles. 10 4. Units on Memorial. You're not directly involved and can leave. Leave the scene. Start answering some of these calls. 